Welcome back to Crypto Turtle. On today's video, we'd like to discuss the graph, how it's currently performing, what we could expect during the upcoming days and weeks, and as well how it currently looks like. But before doing so, do not forget to smash up that subscribe button down below. And even more important, do not forget to smash up those thumbs ups. It will be highly appreciated. So on to this video, I would like to discuss the gross price action. I already opened up the daily time frame and you can clearly see that we are right now inside of a falling wedge pattern. We have already seen multiple touch points underneath this descending resistance and we have as well seen multiple touch points on top of this descending support therefore this is a confirmed falling wedge pattern and what i think is absolutely amazing is that if we do right now actually see a possible breakout occur above this descending resistance and afterwards further continuation towards the upside it is actually a crucial move for the grass price action because we will be seeing a major potential increase of approximately 214 percent so this is for sure something that you do not want to miss out on because this is a major opportunity right now and if we do see this breakout occur above the descending resistance we could see this major increase in price action taking place heading all the way towards the one dollar and 20 cents range perhaps being able to break out above this level of resistance at one dollar and 11 cents find support on top and stay in between these two ranges before seeing further movement towards the upside so for sure this is a major pattern that could take place and i'm looking forward to see if we are going to experience this major breakout on the graph for sure you have to monitor bitcoin for this pattern but this is absolutely something that i think you do not want to miss out on and if you are not yet invested on the graph do not forget that down below in the description you will be able to earn up to 4100 usd tether deposit bonus on bybit by using the link down below so do not forget to do so because this is a major opportunity and i'm personally myself as well looking forward to see if i'm going to accumulate even more the graphs right now so let's take a quick look as well at previous breakouts you can clearly see that previously we did as well see a falling wedge pattern we had multiple touch points beneath this descending resistance and as well multiple touch points on top of this descending support and after we did break out above this descending resistance we saw an incredible movement towards the upside and if we measure this movement towards upside, we can clearly see that this is approximately 118% in 41 days. Well, this is a much bigger pattern that we are seeing right now. So let's say as an estimate, we could say that we are going to search 214%. But this time, I personally think that 90 days is a good possible target. So let's say that before the 26th of April, we could still see a major increase taking place in the gross price action, heading all the way towards the $1.20 range. So that is absolutely amazing. Well, this being said, I would like to take a look immediately at the EMA ribbon and as well at the MACD on the daily time frame what you can clearly see is that the EMA ribbon is actually serving as a level of resistance above us meaning that it is aligning itself together with this descending resistance and therefore if we do right now see a further increase taking place we have to take into consideration that there are multiple layers of resistance above us we are seeing the descending resistance as well we are seeing the EMA ribbon on the daily time frame and this horizontal level of resistance above us where we did clearly see support being found on top previously and if we go even further a major stronghold of support so this is a very important level to break out above if we do see a breakout occur above this descending resistance outside of this falling wedge pattern because if we do get rejected underneath this range it could perhaps be the case that we are going to see a further decline so for sure if we do see a breakout in the immediate short term we would like to see a breakout above the 0 0.53 cents otherwise it is very likely that we will decline even further towards 29 dollar cents down below absolutely important and if we enable the macd what you can clearly see right now is actually looking very well because we did already experience momentum towards the downside so if we do right now see actually an increase in price action taking place heading towards the touch point underneath this descending resistance it could perhaps be the case that we are going to experience as well a possible crossover on the daily time frame macd and expect momentum towards the upside once more therefore we could see a possible breakout here above the 54 dollars cent range and find support on top of it before heading towards the one dollar and 20 cents 
And as I said previously, if we do not break out above this range, it is possible that we will get rejected towards the $29 down below us. Well, this being said, let's discuss the 4 hourly time frame as well. What I think is looking very good on the 4 hourly time frame is that we are actually seeing a retest of the 4 hourly EMA ribbon. We have already seen multiple touch points underneath the EMA ribbon serving as a level of resistance. So right now, if we do see a break on the cure above the EMA ribbon, it could perhaps be the case that we are going to find support on top of it and see further continuation towards the outside heading towards a possible breakout outside of this falling wedge pattern. As well, very important to me is that we did already experience a major increase in momentum towards the upside, but we are right now seeing a continuation of this momentum taking place, meaning that we could still see that further increase taking place and a possible breakout occur above the EMA ribbon. But to be sure about this, we have to monitor the RSI as well but before doing so we are going to take a quick look once more at the macd and see what we are currently seeing we are clearly seeing a lower high on the chart but we are seeing a higher high on the macd indicators line this is a clear bearish divergence on the four hourly macd this is perhaps telling us that we won't be able to break out above the EMA ribbon on the 4 hourly time frame and therefore we could expect a decline taking place and once more we would like to see a stronghold getting created on top of the descending support still being able to stay inside of this falling wedge pattern so this is absolutely crucial for the price action of the graph right now to stay inside of the pattern also let's discuss lastly during this video the rsi on both the four hourly and daily time frame and if we take a look at the rsi on the four hourly time frame it is still looking very good so we are not seeing any type of bullish nor bearish divergences right now so a further increase is still possible so because we are not seeing on both indicators a bearish divergence it could still perhaps be the case that we are going to experience enough momentum to see a further increase in price action going on but we have to monitor the descending resistance closely because we could get rejected underneath it and head straight back down once more on the grass price action but if we head towards the daily time frame and we look at the rsi what you can clearly see is that we are actually below the dotted line and therefore if we do right now experience a further decline it is quite unlikely that we are going to see a major decline in price action taking place instead it is more likely that we are going to create a stronghold where we are currently trading at and see further increase in price action during the upcoming days so the daily rsi is actually looking very well to see a possible breakout occur above the descending resistance during the upcoming days on the grass price section and if this pattern does occur do not forget that we could see a one move getting started all the way towards the one dollar and 20 cents here above us so for sure this is something that you do not want to miss out on hopefully you did enjoy this content and if you did do not forget to give me a big thumbs up down below it will be absolutely highly appreciated and you will be supporting the channel by doing so so thank you very much for watching this video and as well have a nice day.